Need a hand? No thanks, I got it. Sorry about being weird. <laughs> One of the neighbors started borrowing money off of us. So I've just been ignoring everybody all together. Is it Ruth? Yeah. Because she seriously owes me like $80. Really? Yeah. Oh, it's so hard to say no to her because she's so old. old. Now when she comes to the door, we just pretend we're not home. I, I left at the bathroom the other day. Oh. Joel. Shoes. Hold on a second. What? This apartment is infinitely better than my apartment. I don't have a wet bar. Also, Craig let you paint and I love the color. I'm gonna say fennel, is that it? Lamp totally zen. Oh my God, you guys, I would kill for a dishwasher. New iMac. Those are awesome. Uh, there's a built-in webcam and they're made in China. So, I mean, the technology exists for them to be watching you. So I'm just saying, if you're gonna talk about anything like Tiananmen Square, just make sure there's a, you know. All right, all right, I'll talk to you later. Keep it sleazy. Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. When are you gonna learn not to look our neighbors in the eye? What? He's nice. Yeah, Ruth was nice too, till she owed me 50 bucks. And then last week, I had to walk her to the hospital. I'm not gonna ignore everyone. Oh, there's good people in this world. Shh! Hello? It's Ruth. It's Glendon. Okay. Oh, you fucked. <laughs> fine, fine, fine! I have beer. Oh. Pumpkin ale. Spicy. You ready for 2008? What's happening in 2008? Well, it's a countdown, man. That's Beijing Olympics. See, the Chinese see athletic domination as a route to world domination. Can I get my beer? You know, people think that maybe the Chinese don't want to take over the world, but I mean, they do. Why do you think you have an entire generation, 100 to 140 million young people between the ages of 2 and 40, Two point one in the hegemon. You can read about it. I mean, it's a 2,500 year old document about how the Chinese are going to take over the world. And they want to take over the world. I mean, who would? China wants Iran to sink a ship in the Persian Gulf to cut off the flow of oil to Japan. So that's why I'm a ham radio operator. My handle is Tukon. Mind if I use the bathroom? Yeah, it's right there. This China stuff is freaking me out. He's a nutcase. No, he's making a lot of sense. Okay, I've read about this stuff. It's just buried on page nine because the New York Times doesn't get it. Calm down. I'll take care of this. Hey. Hey, Glendon! Oh, this is probably silly, but you're not interested in emergency preparedness, are you? Oh, of course I am. I'm on the community emergency response team. Okay, so I have an extra Israeli gas mask, and it doesn't fit Joel because his head's too big, and I thought, if you wanted, you could try it on and then maybe... Pre-seven-day war post. Oh, seven-day war. I'm interested. Okay, great. It's in my bedroom. I'll show it to you. Okay. Next time you can stay over for breakfast, I make a really good omelet. And I was thinking too, like, what should our song be? And I, the first thing I thought was like Nora Jones, but then she's kind of passe, and I don't want us to be passe, so I was like, you know, maybe like a Joanna Newsome, but I, I don't, I haven't really narrowed it down, so I've got like 10 ideas, I'll just email you the list, and I'll send you some MP3s, and you can just narrow it down okay. from there. Okay, awesome. This was great. It was nice was having you inside me. See you, Josh. You have an amazing gift for awkward sex. I know. So I've made a list of people I would rather not see again, and I thought maybe you could help me out. Just This list is really long. I mean, my body has limits, Joel. I could like maybe do two thirds of this. Okay, well let's narrow it down. Smitty. No. Yeah. Third Eye Blind? All right. My dad. Totally. <laughs> <laughs>